Hey everybody, it's your girl Demetria McKinney from House of Pain and Real Housewives of Atlanta kicking it right here with my folks, Boss Up. Love you guys. Mwah. That was great. Now you did amazing on reality TV this, this year. So. I do think so. I think you came in kicking, okay? I, I think they wasn't ready for you. Thank you. you know, I Reality television is so very sad, angry, and doomed. It's just like everybody's upset, everybody fighting, everybody squabbling. Come on, broad, smile. <laughs> That's all I wanted to do. I wanted to smile, I wanted to show that there's talent, and there are different ways to handle adversity amongst women. You know, we represent that on that show. So, if you have some options, it makes it easier to pick. Now, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar actually just wrote this really great article about how Bravo is helping to end racism. Would you agree with that? And as far as your show goes, because it, it, your show actually, I mean, the Real Housewives of Atlanta has a really rough reputation. So can you maybe, for the critics? How would I feel about, let me start with that, that comment that he made. Um, I think Bravo in general is breaking a lot of barriers, you know, from the programming that they choose that, that caters to homosexual and heterosexual content. Um, Real Housewives of Atlanta definitely, definitely put us African American women on a map, but we have to be really responsible with what we do with that platform. I think that when we really look back and we see what the young ladies are trying to mimic, what they're trying to do, the hair pulling, the thoughtful moments that some of these bras is having, you have to understand that that is all a direct reflection of what everybody else thinks we're doing. So yes, they can definitely be helping, but they have to realize how they help in certain stigmas. And at the same time that you, you know, have been doing the show, you've been doing a great job of also promoting your music career. Yes. How has that, you know, helped your career and also has, has it been a challenge to balance those two things? It has not been a challenge at all. It's like just being in love with something, you're going to do it whenever you can. Um, as far as the show, it definitely helped because people knew I'd sing now. So 3.5 million, got to get it. I don't want to put any pressure on you guys, but we've seen a lot of wedding shows on Bravo. Are we going to get to see the Demetria McKinney, Roger Bob wedding on Bravo? We were definitely approached about it, but I think that what we served our purpose to do was to get the music. Now, if we choose to do it, we're going to do it our way. We're not going to let anybody force us into anything or try to make something that isn't there there. You know what I mean? When we make that step, it'll be because we really want to do it, not for a rating.